Today's routine is all about how you can improve your cubo control and break building skills. Routines which I'm gonna give you in this video are gonna be really realistic and pragmatic. And if you're gonna apply those skills in real game situations, I promise to you that your cubo control, break building and potting skills will improve and automatically you will improve your winning percentage. So if you're interested to improve those things, sit down, watch and enjoy. Let's go. So guys, if you want to learn about break building, this is a very nice routine to do. Three reds below pink ball spot, black on the spot. And there's two ways how you can do this exercise. First way, like right now, put cue ball, hub ball angle below black ball spot or put cue ball higher black ball spot here. The same thing belongs to other side from here and here. So you need to do both sides so you adapt it from to do both ways. So another thing you need to get position higher red, straight or higher red right here. Why? Because it allows you to get position both for the pink and black afterwards. Okay. Let me show you. I will play soft screw back shot and I will get position here. As you can see, I got a nice position. I can easily get for the black or pink. And when you did this one time, you remove the red and you try to get position for a second red right here for the same position where I did last shot. It was like here, sorry. You don't have to be extremely precise, you can be just good enough. Okay, another good shot. Got position for the red there. And I removed the red. And I will try to do last position for the red, also higher the spot. again I got nice position and then you do the same position other side okay now I will show you from the other side so you could get a better idea now cubo is a little bit is hubble higher black ball spot my goal is to make stun shot and also make it straight or higher if you make low it doesn't count so I got nice position and I removed the red. Leave yourself approximately the same angle so you could play always from the same position and try to make position for the second red, straight or higher. Okay, managed to get position. Maybe I was a little bit close so. For the best position, you want to keep about middle distance. You don't want to be too far from the reds and you don't want to be too close. It's a very good reference point as you do breaks. Remove second red. And then the last shot, try to get higher. This time I will try to get middle distance apart. And this is the way how to finish this. Okay, so if you want to try something new, you can also play middle and try to get also straight or higher. Like this. Good. For the reference, I'm just gonna do from other side so you can understand what I mean. Also, straight or higher. And, and what is the position? Okay, it's no good, it's a little bit lower, so I need to be a little bit more precise. Probably I play with too much stop spin, so next time I will use center so I could be a little bit closer to the reds. So this is how I to do analysis when you do a small mistake. 
Okay, this time slightly better. Managed to get slightly above and I'm happy with that. What is your practice plan? How it could look like? My personal recommendation, if you want to improve your skills a lot, you need to practice at least two or three times per week. I recommend to practice at least from 50 minutes to 30 minutes per session. And I promise to you, if you're going to do this for two weeks, one month, two months consistently, you will improve a lot. Because those shots are realistic in real game situations, and you're always going to get them, no matter what kind of situation you have on the table. Scrappy frame, normal situation, or something in between, you're going to have them. So... If you enjoyed this video, make sure you leave in the comment section and just let me know how you were doing with this routine. And if you enjoyed, you can text me privately and we can have a conversation about your improvement. Okay, guys, that's it from my side. Take care and have a nice day. Peace.